Welcome to Lynn's Recipes. Tonight I'm making spicy garlic shrimp. This is an easy recipe that requires very few ingredients. I'm going to show you what they are right now. You'll need some fettuccine or spaghetti and you'll need only half of this box. This is a pound. You'll need a half a pound and you just cook it according to the package directions. You'll need three large tomatoes that you've chopped. You'll need a pound of shrimp and this was frozen. I defrosted it. I peeled it and I took the tails off. You'll need some basil that you have shredded like little ribbons, or you could use dried basil if you don't have access to fresh basil. You'll need about two tablespoons of fresh chopped garlic, and this is Parmesan cheese, and this is what we're going to top the dish with when we're all done. Okay, so the first thing we have done is we've put a generous amount of olive oil in the bottom of this pan, and now we're going to add our tomatoes and let them cook for about 15 minutes. And while they're cooking, I'm gonna take a fork and I'm going to kind of mash them a little bit so that it kind of makes a sauce. So, turn that up just a little bit. That cooled the oil down quite a bit. So, bring that back up to heat and then just let it cook until we have a sauce. Okay, as you can see, these tomatoes are cooking down quite nicely and we're making a really nice sauce here. So we'll continue doing this for a few more minutes before we add the rest of the ingredients. Okay, our tomatoes are done, so now it's time to add the rest of our ingredients. So we're going to add our shrimp, our basil, whoops, garlic, And some salt and pepper and this is to taste the salt and pepper so just whatever you like and you can add more later if you want to now what I'm going to do is stir this all together and I'm going to cook it until the shrimp are pink and then it will be done okay so our shrimp is done you want to make sure that you don't overcook shrimp because if you do it will get tough so now what I'm going to do is take it over to the counter and finish up our meal. Okay, so I have my fettuccine on my um, platter here. So what I'm simply going to do is pour my shrimp down the middle. Okay, and then I'm going to take my Parmesan cheese and I'm just going to grate it over the top. can do as much or as little as you like. It's just a personal preference of how much cheese you like. So this is my spicy garlic shrimp. I hope you enjoy it.